At this time, we believe the cables were cut and there's a deliberate act of vandalism. The Sea to Sky gondola in Squamish is closed indefinitely after a rope broke early Saturday morning. Police are treating this as a criminal in nature and have not ruled out that this is a deliberate act. We recognize the potential of what could have been and are thankful that no one was injured. It happened around 4.30 a.m. An employee working at the summit heard a loud bang and discovered the haul rope had been broken. Well, the helicopter woke us up this morning, like over at the chief campground, and uh, just they were like surveying the damage. Fortunately, no one was hurt as the gondola was not operating at the time of the fall. We are currently assessing the damage, which will help us identify the cause of the incident. We will continue our investigation and release updates to you as soon as possible. The RCMP are presently working with Technical Safety BC and Doppelmeyer, and efforts are currently being made to walk the gondola line so that it can be properly inspected. Gondola cabins can be seen on the ground, and there's currently no indication of if or when the attraction will be reopened. That's insane. That's I'm so glad no one is hurt. How did that happen? So, what if there's people in there riding, and then all of a sudden, you know, like, oh, I don't know. I, it's just scary to think about it, you know, right now. At this time, it's a crime scene. It's been closed by the police. The trails in the area can be hiked to the top of the chief. I mean, we know that there were people that hiked to the top of the chief this morning, and we're asking that anybody in the area who did hike the trails come forward to speak to police. We are looking for witnesses. The trails in the area may have been used to access the gondola line. The public is asked to avoid the area, and anyone with any information is asked to contact Squamish RCMP. In Squamish, Ashley Burr, City News.